We're here with James Thomas, who takes James Thomas Jr. Damn, right, yeah. Who takes over the special teams coordinator. Uh, I'm sure you've seen some film on Maryland specials. Uh, how do you make improvements in a special teams organization? Uh, well, we're gonna. We did a great job this off season of uh, like doing an extensive like self scout, seeing the things that we did well and we didn't do well, uh, making sure we we attack. Some simple details to clean up. We're, we're not. We wasn't too far, man. Some of the errors that occurred last year was, was again self-inflicted, um, and, and just like changing the mentality, making sure our mentality, you know, my guys understand that we're coming in uh, all phases to to make an impact, make an impact, and, and, and take pride in it. And I think we were close. Uh, we just had some, some, some minor errors. You had a transfer kicker come in. Looks to be legit. His name escapes you at the moment, but I'm sure you know. Yeah, who he Chad. Is. Chad is uh, Chad around. He's he's a he's a has a powerful leg. Um, he does a great job of. Uh, I can't wait to get get our hands on him in um, the spring. He's here now. I'm um, looking forward to, to seeing him like kick off, kick field goals. Um, he's our transfer in from Eastern Michigan, so we we we're excited to have him. Um, looking forward to seeing what he can do for us. Hi, I'm Maryland wide receiver Rakim Jarrett. If you've been hurt in a car crash, people will tell you you need a lawyer. My mom says you need my lawyer, the Jack Litch Law Group. Find out why clients, judges, and other lawyers call us the big dogs from the small firm. Every single lawyer at the Jack Litch Law Group was honored by best lawyers in America. In the Jack Litch Law Group was the best decision anyone in my family has ever made, other than my decision to play football at the University of Maryland. At 855-BIG-DOG-1. Don't just get a lawyer. Get, get the, the lawyers. lawyers. If you're hurt, listen to my mom and bite back with the big dogs. Can you reach the end zone on the kickoff? <laughs> that's, that's what the fam showed us. So hopefully, hopefully he, he take care of business and do that for us. Is, co is coverage on special teams more about you know, mental focus? Or is, I mean, is that they, you know, what goes into being a good coverage? Well, it's, it's, it's a mentality one, um, taking pride in it. And then also scheme, like making sure we dial it up and, and make it it's making it easy for our guys to understand what we do. And we're covering on special teams. We are we're, we're defensive players, you know what I mean? So we we got to make sure we have the three layers on defense. You got the you know, your front line, your second your second line of defense, and then your your secondary. So we want to make sure we create that type of um, that type of scheme for our guys to understand that we're intentional with what we're doing that and be and have some mentality. As well. After last year, was there discussion about maybe the experiment of uh, wide receivers or kickoff returns is done? Or <laughs> not, I, uh, no, I, I don't know if it was an experiment. We, we, we put the best players back there, the guys that we think are going to give us an advantage. Um, and the best player is going to play. We feel like it's, it's one of our best receivers. We put them there. Um, but the best player is going to be the ones that's going to be able to, whoever can make that impact for us, that's what we want back there. Having have have so many guys on the team, I'm curious, you have receivers, do you ever say, all right, you're going to be the kick returner, you're going to be the punt returner, is that the philosophy? Or? Yeah, we have those guys, like, we, we have them, we have guys who just run, uh, return kickoff, we have guys who just punt returners, and we have guys that do both, so um, it's, whoever the best at it will be the one that will take the field. What? What happened in your career, your love of football, that you said, hey, I'm your special teams guy? Uh, well, for me, I, I, again, the story is, is, is unique uh, coming from the D2 ranks and, and, and again, getting a break here last year and now being here. Uh, I, I've been a special teams coordinator. I like the, the fact that I'm, I have hands on both sides of the ball, um, where I can build relationships with uh, with all those guys, and then you just, just have more of an imprint, you know, imprint on the team. And um, and so, and then you, you have like six phases or, or that you can really use and and, and and be the coordinator of. You know, so I'm excited about that. In terms of uh, punt returns, I mean, they have Maryland hasn't had an explosive punt return since maybe DJ Turner a few years ago. Um, and obviously they have athletes that can get it done, but is, it, is that about more blocking? How do you, how do you spring fire? Oh, again, you saw the bowl game? Yeah, well, yeah. Oh, okay, okay, so I think uh, we have 
we have with this roster, we, we have enough skilled guys that can return putts. We just got to get you know, get them back there. We, we, we again the, the blocking, all that stuff is just things that we were working very intensely uh, on in the spring ball. But but I, I think we, we got the guys that can do it and skill set wise. And we're gonna make sure we, we block well for them and, and get the best athletes back there. To Eve is it's a heck of a return. Uh, Jason Jones is a heck of a return. We just got to keep guys out of space, out of their face.